Hi, this is Not Too Fast here. In this video, I will show you this portable LCD digital microscope. Now, I got this for an upcoming project, which you'll see in a couple of weeks. And I'll be using this to rework some surface mount devices on a circuit board. This unit has 600 times magnification. The image has a 1080p high definition resolution and it's displayed on a 4.3 inch color LCD display. There's also a built in 2500 milliamp power lithium polymer battery which can operate for more than six hours. So let me unbox this and I'll show you what comes with this unit. Here's a microscope unit. USB cable. Metal stand. Metal base. This is a USB charger with the EU plug, but you can use any USB charger to charge this microscope. But if you want to use this charger in the US, then you will need to get an adapter for the plug. Let's assemble the stand. Take this bracket and these screws. And we'll mount it to the base right here. Now take the stand and we'll screw it into the stand right here. Place a microscope into the stand and there are two screws on the side that you can tighten to hold it in place. Let's have a look at this microscope. On the front we have this focus dial. Use this to adjust the focus. Next to it is the LED status. Over here is a power button. If you press this once, the unit will turn on. Here is a menu button. You press this once. Now we're in the camera setup menu. You can use the right and left arrow key to scroll up and down. Press the OK button to select. Resolution default is 1080p. You can change this to 720p or VGA. Date tag. You can add a date to the recorded image. Motion detection. Cyclic record. Back to resolution. Press the menu again. This is the unit setup menu. First item is format. You can insert a memory card on the side right here and it will record a video or take a snapshot. So after you install the memory card, you can go into format to format the memory card. Next menu is language setting. Auto power off. Defaults off. Screen saver. Defaults off. Reset system if you want to reset to factory default. Frequency, 50 hertz or 60 hertz. Time setting, here you can set the time. Video rotate, to rotate the image. Fill light, by default is on. Version of the software. Press menu again. Now we're back to the main video screen. You can also press mode button right here. If you have a memory card installed and you press the OK button, it'll take a snapshot. Press mode button. For playback, press it again, back to video mode. On the side, we have a mini USB connector for charging the unit. This is a micro SD memory card slot. This dial here is for adjusting the brightness of the LED. So looking at the bottom here, in the middle is the camera lens. And around the side are the LEDs for illumination. To turn off the unit, press and hold the power button. Here I have a USB flash drive. I'll place it on the stand. Now I'll turn on the unit. Now you can use a dial at the back here to adjust the magnification. The closer you are, the higher the magnification. Use a dial at the front to adjust the focusing and then use a dial on the side to increase or decrease the brightness on the LED lights. Now if you want to charge the unit you can use any USB charger and plug the mini USB connector on the side right here. Here's a close-up look of how well this microscope works. Now if you find the contrast to be a little bit too bright, you adjust the brightness of the LED.
Now I've gone ahead and installed a micro SD memory card into the unit. While we're in the video mode, if you press the OK button, it'll start recording. Now this unit records an AVI video file. When you're done, press the OK button. Press the mode button to toggle to the playback mode. Here's a video file. Press OK to play it. Now if you press the mode button to the camera mode, press OK, it'll take a snapshot. Press the mode button again, go into the playback mode. Now you can press the right arrow or left arrow to scroll through the different pictures and videos. To turn off the unit, simply press the power button and hold it for a second. So far I'm really impressed with the performance of this digital microscope. With its 600 times magnification and high definition picture, it does a really good job at magnifying the object. There are many uses for this. You can use this for science, electronic project, jewelry making, watch repair, and I'm sure there are many other uses for this. This unit is also very compact and portable. With its internal lithium polymer rechargeable battery, you can run this for six plus hours, so you can use this anywhere you go. Now I got this at gearbest.com and it retails for $65. If you want to get this, I will include the link in the description below. Now I also want to let you know GearBest will soon be coming out with their own car dash camera and it's called the AlphaWise MB05. I've been told this dash cam performs very well with good daytime and nighttime recording. So once I get that product, I will do a review on it. So stay tuned for that. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, leave one in the comment section. And don't forget to click on thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.